grow this plant in bigger pots or you can grow them in small size pots you can put them in small small planters like coffee mugs and tea jugs this plant fits into any size of pot and most of all these plants purifies the air and one of the best air purifier plant you can cut a leaf from this plant and put it in water to propagate keep it in the shade not in the sunny area snake plants will fit into the low light areas in your garden and they will grow very beautifully or else if you put them indoors in a low light corner that also will be enough for these plants to grow really well soil should be well draining you should uh, have some garden soil along with some compost and bit of sand so one third of sand one third of garden soil and one third of coco peat even will do for these plants so that will be the preparation of the soil and soil media should be well draining that is the most important thing one thing to keep in mind about these plants are not to over water you are killing your plant by over watering so time to time providing these plants watering will be enough because these plants doesn't need regular watering see to the soil level check the soil level and water these plants and when you water also do not water the leaves of this plant always water the roots of the plant so here I have put the variegated leafy one and also the normal snake plant both in one pot. I have not put them separately because I love it that way. At that time I didn't have a separate pot, a planter. So I put this together in the same pot and also it creates a beauty to me in my eye. So I like it that way. You can plant this separately if you want. So when they produce more baby plants you can divide and multiply them. Now here is one plant and this another one so there are about three plants in the same pot here are my sensevaria collection they are in small small pots so friends this is the jade plant i have a jade plant collection in my balcony i have kept them outdoors i have not kept it indoors because these plants requires a lot of morning sunlight five to six hours of sunlight for a healthy plant they need sunlight because they are succulent plants and this plant i have kept outdoors so this is not an indoor plant according to me because according to my experience you have to give them lots of sunlight in the morning because of the shade their leaves will fall out so this is a beautiful feng shui plant this is a jade plant so i will show you my cuttings here are some of my plants now this is a bit huge plant that is also in a small to medium sized pot so here are the other collection of mine this is in a mark jade plant grows well in the sunlight and also that should be medium to partial sunlight and even the bright sunlight you can keep it but not so much give it about three to four hours of sunlight in the morning and uh, do not water this plant regular basis you can water them the top layer of the soil is dried out and when the plant is need of water you can do that so this is a succulent plant you don't need to regular water and also this plant so very easy to propagate even a small stem will do so the soil should be well draining that you will have to keep in mind and one more tip you will have to pinch the plant on the top always keep pinching and you can do the same thing on your small small plants even because they will produce more leaves from the place where you pinch so pinch on the top that will make the plant more bushier so that is one tip of growing jade plant so what is the best fertilizer for the jade plant time to time you can give coffee or tea fertilizer for these plants dried coffee or tea leaves you can use during the rainy season and liquid form you can give during the summer season so these plants are feng shui plants and also really very easy to grow permanent and low maintenance plants 
So what is the soil mixture for this plant? You can always add garden soil, then use some sand and also you can add some perlites as well for the preparation of soil. So it should be well draining. That is the most important thing. See that there is a good drainage hole in your pots. So medium to small pots will do for jade plants. You don't need bigger pots because they are very happy with the smaller ones. So always put some cuttings in small pots, DIY plant as whatever the pot is available. See that there is a good drainage hole and you keep it in area where they get a lot of sunlight. And when the rainy season see that you have shifted them to a place where the plants are not get too much of rainy water. Exposure too much to the rainy water is not good for these plants. So shift them to an area where they doesn't get caught too much of rain that is also very important so friends i hope you find this video very useful i have described about the snake plant and also jade plants both are succulents and unlikely to the snake plant this plant you can keep outdoors in an area where they get a lot of sunlight in the morning so these are the tips of caring for jade plant and snake plant if you are new consider to subscribe to my channel thank you